coffee time. What up everyone? How are we doing today? It's the first ride in exactly a month. Uh, a little over a month. Holy crap, a lot has happened. We had an oil leak on the bike that's been going on for a while. I knew about it. <laughs> um, let me tell ya. I'm not gonna say the shop. They uh, f***ed me up. They had my bike for almost three weeks just to finish this stupid oil leak, to do the to do the 10,000 mile service, and to change some other stuff. So, really simple, like a gasket in here. I think they changed that right there. That was what they changed. I'm not really sure. Some other stuff, the clutch is still a little loose, whatever. And that took almost three weeks, and I tried to talk with them and get it resolved, and they were like, Oh, blah, 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 and then, uh, I take the bike in. They call me on the day after I turn it in. I'm in, I'm in Virginia at this point. I'm not even in Ohio. And I, they call me and say, hey, we want to do these things. Uh, we found where the oil leak's at, and we used to replace some O-rings. No biggie. I'm like, awesome. They wanted to change the brake fluid, uh, flush it, change it, uh, front and rear, and then they wanted to do the same thing with the radiator fluid. Uh, ice or coolant, I mean, sorry. And I was like, ah, take off the coolant, take off the uh, take off the brake stuff. I'll do that myself. That took off two hundred fifty dollars off the final price. I was like, yeah, whatever, it's fine. Fast forward, I'm in Virginia. I'm driving back to Ohio on Sunday, and I call them like, hey, is my bike done yet? And they're like, oh yeah, no. So here's what we have, and they read me the estimate again, and I'm like, what? I already told you. <laughs> I already told you what I wanted done. And they're like, oh, oh, well, we need to get your verification. And like, oh, I'm, who did you talk to? And I'm like, uh, I don't know who I talked to, but I talked to someone and they called me and I told them this guy, okay, get to work. So that backed it up. They didn't even order the parts yet they needed. So I'm like literally less than a week out from moving away from school, moving back to school. And they have my bike and I can't do anything about it. I mean, obviously I can take it back, but it's like they already ordered the parts. So then they said the parts are going to be in a week. Uh, they, they're going to be in pretty soon. Pretty soon. And they were lying about a bunch of stuff too. I know. Just to make me feel like they weren't sitting on their asses. Which is what, exactly what they were doing. A week later, they I, I call again. I have, to, I have to keep going back and asking and asking and asking. They don't do s*** for me, man. It's just really frustrating. There's a lot of things that went on. It was just really frustrating. But anyway, I'm back. I'm back and I'm happy dude I'm so happy to ride I've been away for three weeks at school practicing football I play college football if you didn't know that about me I'm really tired my knees kind of hurt right now I can't really put much weight on it uh, but I'm glad to be back I'm so happy to be riding Jeez, I know I'm repeating myself but man riding is such a good experience if you have never ridden a motorcycle you just you just don't know what I'm talking about it's one of the best thing, feelings in the world is to just going on a ride after a long day, man. Ah, so happy to be out here. Uh, uh, uh. The sun is blinding me. God dang that sun, brat. Say that you love me. Oh, hey, ho, ho. I don't want to give a damn. I want to get copyrighted. I'll be singing too much. I know I mentioned in one of the last videos I posted that. I got my cardo back in the music, dude. It's such a vibe. I love it. I love it. I cannot ride without music anymore, I think. What's up, bud? Looks pretty, man. I think I'm gonna go left. I usually don't go left. I go with my comfort. That's a good rev match. What's up? What's up? <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Let's go! Yeah! <laughs> do I do it? I go. <laughs> oh shit! I 
I'm glad I at least remember to put my kickstand down. That would have been embarrassing as hell. And that's something I would do too, is to forget to put my kickstand down trying to be funny. Let me tell you something about college. If you're not in college, or if you graduate from college, here's a little memory for you. The mattresses, bro. What were the mattresses like? That's right. They were either rock hard or like nothing. Like just soft as sh There's no in between. There is no decent medium mattress in college. For me, I like a little on the hard side. I got stuck with like something that I like sink into like a cartoon, you know? Terrible. Terrible. I cannot wake up and like stand straight up for the first hour after I wake up. It's terrible. I hate it so much. Yeah, I'm a big biker. I got a massive dick. I like your shirt. I don't know that guy. I like his shirt. It's a cool shirt. I don't really have anything to talk about today. I just kind of want to... Do my thing. A Hot Wheels of that car. I've been looking for one. I was gonna give it away to someone, but I never see them until now when I'm riding. Going the opposite way. Hot take. Electric motorcycles. What are your thoughts? I got. Here's my opinion. I don't. I might be a little controversial. Um. Basically, I would 110% ride. When you say shadow, go. Here's one right now. Take it out for an hour. Have fun. No cops, bro, I'm, whew. I mean that, I would 110% do that, beyond the shadow of a doubt. You give me an electric motorcycle ride, I would ride it. I, I want to experience that, because like, they always say like zero, like, or not zero, <laughs> they always say instant acceleration, how, is, how much of that is cap? I mean, okay, instant acceleration, think about that. I'm cranking. Okay, think about that. When I accelerate, watch this. That's accelerating. That's a little more than I wanted to do. Uh, that's accelerating. Instant acceleration, what? Is it like, do I, do I like twist this? Do I go twist and then like, boom, like that? Like, that's not, no. I think everything's like instant acceleration. I guess, I guess it's just, I don't know. I don't really get the instant acceleration bit of why electric things are awesome. Is this an everything instant electric? I don't know. Now, would I ever own an electric motorcycle? No. No, I would not. Absolutely not. Never. Not own one because I don't think they're that fun. After a while, I think they get boring. Obviously, the speed is one thing, but listen, on the streets, unless you're some Jixer bra type guy, you ain't going 180 between cars on a road like this. You're going the speed limit, or closer to the speed limit, and you're going to be able to use that bike to half its potential. You're going to be going not even, maybe 25% of what it can do most of the time. Most of the time. Um... The other time we're just gonna be going like I am right now. It's gonna be kind of annoying going to like the stoplights like this. That'd be so annoying. Like even though it, it took me time to adjust to this and this is like different because I have riding modes. I can like tamper it down if I want to. But somewhat at least. But if electric bikes just, I don't feel like they'd be that fun. I don't feel like they'd be that comfortable to ride in the city setting. Track? Sure, sure. I like to see track. But here's what makes bikes fun. Did you hear that? That's what makes motorcycles fun. That sound. That's what makes them fun. Electric motorcycles? Bro, I don't want something sounding like, I don't know, like my remote control helicopter I got when I on my uh, ninth birthday. Electric bikes, dude, uh, I feel like you get so bored of them so quickly. Despite the power and whatever, they don't have that sound. I literally, I'm, I'm not even kidding right now. One of the biggest reasons I chose this bike is for the sound. It's so distinct. It's so distinct.
It's an inline three. It sounds amazing. I love it. It is one of my most favorite sounds in the world to date. I thought I loved the inline four. Holy shit, I love this. It's meatier than the inline four, but it still has that high pitch like whine to it. That little, oh my gosh, dude, I love it. I love it. I can't imagine riding this bike without it. It wouldn't nearly be a quarter of the fun. It'd be it'd be 25% fun. <laughs> I can't imagine it without it. It gets me going on this bike. It's what? Okay, whoa, pause. It gets me... Ex uh, you get the point. Oh, man, look how beautiful it is out. Uh, summer's ending and I'm sad. Pisses me off. This is where lane splitting comes in handy, folks. So you don't want another car length of traffic in front of you? Let me lane split. If you haven't, follow me on TikTok. I post stuff. Not as of recently, but I, I will be posting stuff. Very soon. Competent human beings make me happy. <laughs> And I'm alive to be happy. Oh. Smoker mom. What you got through that mask is disgusting. Oh my gosh. That mask is disgusting. Dude, it was like the color of like black. I don't want to speak too loud. I thought you might hear me. He's staring at me. He got like that toddler stare like he didn't know what to make of me But he's he's not really happy <laughs> He gave me that look that like kids see when they see a disabled person. Thank you for watching and sticking around for this somewhat shortish video um, We'll see how long how short it is after I finish editing but Thank you for watching really appreciate it. Go follow me on TikTok and Instagram um, same at as my YouTube channel Hope to see you there. I'm going to be posting some more stuff. At least try to. Um, in the coming weeks. But. Yeah. I really want to make. Make some. Some stuff. <laughs> Dude look like Pulse. From where you must succeed. Thank you for watching though. I really do appreciate it. Um, leave a comment. Or something. Love talking to y'all. Um, I also am getting very bored at school, so please give me some interaction to help me stay alive. Thank you so much for watching. Um, as always, if you like the video, like it. If you dislike it, dislike it. I don't care. I do this for myself. This is fun. So yeah. Peace out, guys.